explore your Haymat site, start by logging in using the ID and password given to you. Upon logging in, you will land on the dashboard. This is the go-to place for a snapshot of all your activities on the website. It shows your login details, lessons accessed, and assignments accessed and submitted. Click on the Lessons tab to view the lesson resources. Choose a topic, browse through concepts or hands-on activities or math tools or games in that topic and choose a lesson. Click on the thumbnail of the lesson that you want to see. You can load the audio and use the slider buttons for navigation. The menu on the top right corner will let you navigate to the different drop-downs within the lesson. You can use the print button to print out the screen. The magnifying lens helps you magnify any part of the screen you want to. Most lessons will have sample questions for you to practice, which will be in the last drop-down of the lesson. Look up your assignments by simply clicking on the Assignments tab. You could be given a quiz, a worksheet, or a reading assignment by your teacher. For the assigned quizzes, you can check the status. If it is grey, the quiz has not been attempted by you. Click on the blue button in the I column to see the details of the quiz. The quizzes can be in three different modes. Test, Adaptive Practice or Standard Practice. This quiz is in test mode which are timed events. So make sure you are aware of the allocated time before starting the quiz. The due date and solution date will also be given by your teacher. Click on Start when you are ready. Go through the questions and answer by clicking on the correct radio button. Make sure you save your answers. A dot below the question number tells you that you have answered the question already. You can use the equation editor to type in fractions, etc. Finish the quiz and click on the Submit button. It will give you the time you have taken for this quiz. Click on OK. You will see your score immediately. The solutions will be available on and after the solution due date set by your teacher. If you go back to your quizzes list, you will notice that the quiz you submitted has become green, indicating that you have finished it. You could attempt more quizzes in the same way. This quiz is in the adaptive practice mode. Notice that this is not timed. You can view the solution immediately after attempting the question. All the quizzes you have been assigned will be there in your quiz list. You can always go back to them. Click on Worksheets under the Assignments tab. You can see if any of your friends have submitted. You can be the first. Check the due date. You can download this worksheet in either of the formats, as a doc or as a PDF. Once you have worked out your solutions, you can save it again in a Word or a PDF format. Click on Assignment Submission. Type in any message that you may want to convey. and attach your worked out solution file. Alternatively, you could also type in your answers in the message box. Finally, click on the submit button and then on the yes button. You can see that you have submitted it on time. Under the assignments tab, click on reading. You can view the lessons allocated to you by your teacher for self-study. The tick 
beside the lesson indicates that you have read this lesson. Click on reports to view your activities. You can edit your profile by clicking on this icon and then the profile tab. Change the password. and also add the email address to which all future communication to you will be addressed. Click Save and then OK to save your profile change. In case you forget your password, click on Forgot Password next to the Sign In button. The link to reset your password will be sent to the email ID updated in the profile. You can also click on this icon and then the contact us tab for any queries. Choose the topic you want to clarify, type in your email address, add your message. You can also attach a file. Happy exploring! Have fun!